Welcome back everyone. So I'm super excited because we are now building our kind of a look of and feel of our website. We're putting, I'm going to show you how to take this. up our theme for Amazon site. Uh, like I said, we're trying for efficiency. So we're trying for good enough and not perfection. We're trying to create 10 actual blog sites so that we can start scaling this and have little income producing assets. So with our roofing supply company, we are going to make this super easy. We're going to go ahead and go to our themes or appearances rather and go to themes. And then they come with these default. We're just going to add a new theme and do astral. It's fast, it's lightweight. It's, uh, it's, yeah, it's good enough. But if you have another option, um, yeah, do that. I'm going to go with what's, what's easy. And then I'm going to install Spectra. Create new page. And then I'm going to go to design library, head over to this little setting right here and go to personalize library. And then as you can see, it says build 10 times faster with starter templates and zip WP. So we get 100,000 credits free. So we're just going to use those and boom, connect our WordPress to the good old site. And now we're going to name the website in our description. So it's going to be roofing supply co and a roofing supply company. We're going to click next and now please describe roofing supply company. So we'll just use AI. So I just ask AI to uh, create this. I am clicking next, put in my information here, or I can just skip this step. And here we are. So we have all sorts of building materials. These are pretty looking pretty good. I actually like this one. Uh, maybe this one. Maybe we can find a good metal roof somewhere. Uh, this looks pretty good. Maybe this and we'll click next. Try using the thousand free credits. So this is what it comes up with and now we don't need to pay anyone. So this looks pretty solid. I mean, you're a real reliable partner. I like this one actually too, with it kind of, um, back. Actually, this is looking, this one's looking pretty good. And this one, I would say both of these are pretty, are good choices. Probably this one. Yeah. I'm, I'm liking this one. So boom. There we go. There's our main page. Uh, I I feel like I've seen a better, like it created a better one for me. Let's see. My out of credits already. Page header. All right. Maybe I picked too many images. Shouldn't have picked too many images. So that was, that was a bad one. I've done it on other pages and it, it did the whole thing, but uh, that's fine. We can just expand on this. We're going to go from patterns since we screwed that up to kits and we're just going to look up roofing and we're just going to grab us something that works for us. So leading roofing service, uh, we'll just go with this one right here, roofing agency. Um, we can change some of the stuff. I think it's good enough. Insert template. And now we're just going to change some of this stuff, but it's good enough. I'm going to just publish it. I'll probably obviously make it so it's more roofing um, supply versus roofing uh, agency or roofing uh, services. All right. So we have that as our main page. It looks pretty solid. We'll have someone take over obviously and update a lot of this, but it's a far cry. This is where it was from this. So, um, I mean, nothing to at least something so that we can start creating, at least have a, a, a image of a roofing company. And now we can start creating blogs and automating a lot of the processes. All right. So we do want to make sure that our main page is what it is instead of just like a, um, if we refresh this, it might look like 
a blog. So all we're going to do is go to our themes, customize it, click on customize, and we're going to look for homepage and we're going to set it to a static. And as for our homepage, we actually want the one we just created. So look for that. If it's the first one or the sample page, just see which one is the right one. We'll update the name in a little bit. Uh, from here, once it is solid, we'll probably want to obviously change the header. Uh, we'll probably change some other things, but uh, for now, this is good enough. Uh, this post page, we'll actually add a post page here in a little bit, but let's just go ahead and publish this. So we'll go ahead and click on this header click right here, primary header. We can do all sorts of fun things here. I like to just keep it small. Uh, if we click on the actual background, so if we go to design background, we'll change the black maybe. Uh, let's go black and then we can change the actual color of the text by going to a title color and changing it to white here. And then we have a menu here, so we'll have to change the menu. So we'll go ahead and publish this. Um, we'll probably just change the name. So instead of Roofing Supply Co., We'll just maybe do like that, Roofing Supply Co. And then obviously you go back to white. I don't know why it changed, so it's weird. But let's just do that. So we don't want it to hover. We'll just publish and then refresh. And then we'll want to make sure that we also put in the menu. So we'll do that now. We'll have to go to the menu button. Uh, so we'll go back to our website. Now we're going to head over to the menu and we actually need to add these categories. So we have our main menu. All you do is type in main, I put in main menu here. We're going to go to categories. Uh, we're going to refresh or we're going to view all actually roofing supply. We'll add these here. So we have our categories here. We'll go ahead and save that. And then we'll go back to our appearance and themes and customize. And then we'll go down to our home site and you can see it right here, roofing supply, all the different things, but we want to change what it looks like. So as you can see, it's now up here and all we have to do is just head over to design. We'll scroll down and change the color. So we'll just change it to white. So now we have the roofing, costs, roofing insulation, and roofing material. So all sorts of great things. If they mouse over it, I think it changes colors. So there's all sorts of different things you can do. You can change the, the menu font. So if you want to do like poppin, you can do that. So it makes it much more uh, nice looking. And so we have our menu button here. We can see how it looks on the mobile. If we click on this, you can see that it doesn't have, it's not mobile um, optimized. So, so we're just gonna click on this little menu button, click on a configure menu here, and then just select off canvas menu and change it to main menu. And then if we click on this, you can see, boom, we are set. We're gonna go ahead and publish this. And if we refresh this page, we have our website. So boom, we are looking at pretty good. We pretty much have everything we need to get done. There are a few other things we can do like set up the contact page and so forth, privacy settings. Right, so let's handle that now. We're gonna go to appearances. We're gonna go to customize again. We're gonna go to footer builder and you might just have copyright so we're gonna add HTML one and social. Go and click on copyright. And I deleted the powered by the theme. I'm not gonna give them a bad backlink. And I just added a little heart there just for, for love. And then uh, go ahead and click on the link here and click on HTML one and then click on socials. And once you have that up, it should look like this. So I have my social HTML one and copyright Go ahead and change your socials so that you have a backlink to yourself. And I'm going to do Roofing Supply Co. So it'd be like facebook.com forward slash pages forward slash Roofing Supply Co. Twitter, if you want to keep that or you don't, you can just delete it or keep it. Instagram, same thing. 
and I'll probably do uh, maybe some uh, Reddit or Medium, whatever I can automate. But for now, choose whatever you want. Maybe some YouTube. Boom. So something to definitely think about. And then once we have both of those, we're going to actually um, pull up the section here. So we'll go ahead and publish that. And then from here, HTML, all I have is important links and I have privacy policy and terms of use. So we're gonna go ahead and create these two links right now um, under pages. We're gonna create our privacy and terms of use and then let's uh, do some housekeeping and change this to like main page or s roofing supply co. So roofing supply co. And doesn't that look better? And delete. Now we already have a privacy that was already created for us. So we're just gonna go ahead and publish that. Uh, obviously you talk to a lawyer, if you were doing something that was like important, uh, then you might wanna be mindful of what you're you know, doing uh, because uh, you don't wanna be in trouble with the law. Uh, and I'm just a YouTuber and not a lawyer. So you definitely want to make sure that you are uh, following your current laws and all of that. Or you can ask ChatGPT to create you one. So I'm just going to use this one. Uh, I think it's a little bit better than the free one that was on uh, the site. So I'm just going to use this one. Obviously, like I said, do not use this as the end all be all. This is only for quick and easy and fast. This is not for uh, legal purposes. All right, so I saved it to my uh, privacy policy. This is all here. And then I'm gonna append it to my footer. And now we need to do the same thing with our terms of use. So same thing here, we're gonna copy paste the privacy policy link, but we're just gonna call it terms of use, terms hyphen of hyphen use, just like this, boom, save and publish. So now we have all of our links there. We're going to go ahead and design our page. So create a new page, go ahead and type in terms of use, go to chat GPT. I'm just going to copy all of this. Boom. And paste it into my little thing here. Obviously this is not, like I said, use this if you want. I'm not responsible for anything that you do, hire someone. Make sure that you don't have any new pages added. I had automatically add new top level. Don't have that checked. Uh, once that's saved, your website should be looking pretty sweet uh, if you decided to do everything. So if we scroll to the top, we have Roofing Supply Co. We have our little hovers with changing of the colors. Uh, we have our supply list, which we'll update later. Um, get our price list. They have a phone number, which we'll grab later. We don't really need that. Uh, websites looking good. Pictures, everything. Everything's looking pretty solid. We'll obviously capture this. We have a, our privacy policy in terms of use. So if we click on those, boom and boom. So we are good to go. So our appearance privacy policy, websites live, we can literally just start posting our uh, images to Pinterest and start really doing, uh, getting some sales. R next up, we are going to uh, start gathering some products. We're gonna start doing some internal linking. We're gonna actually push this in motion. There are some little things I would do wanna tie up. Maybe we'll do a little housekeeping video on uh, maybe doing the capture page and a few other things. But now is the time to set this loose. Definitely come out, join our Discord where we're going over more. We have a group who's uh, building out to 10 websites that are all making money, so you definitely don't wanna miss that. But this was a little bit longer of a video. We do have some housekeeping here uh, coming up in the, in the next video, but I'm excited because we already have a full website ready to go. And let's do this.